Let's go Sergeant here with another video for you all and today. We're going to be looking at something a bit different. I've been kind of contemplating going back to this or not, which is The Division. Um, okay, so the new Survival DLC is coming out pretty, pretty soon. It's set to launch on the 22nd of November and I am uber, uber hyped for it. And I will be posting some more videos on it. So I'm just going to go break it down and stuff like that. I'm just going to... Um, like, go into some in-depth thoughts, I've read the um, patch notes, I've read the analyses, and people have already pretty much guessed what I'm going to probably say, but, you know, um, okay, so the first thing I realised was, from, from the gameplay I saw, was the base, um, the base of operations that you normally operate from, and you can go get from missions, you can either access the underground from it, um, it is completely going to be locked out, it's going to be locked down, no no in, no out sort of thing, um, because of the bad weather that the DLC has put in, okay, um, and I think that's going to be a big, big problem, I think that's going to leave no access to the underground, people may be angry about that, um, which brings me on to my next point actually um it might not be like the other expansions where it just kind of slots into the game nicely it might just be a game mode on its own so it might just be a standalone game mode where you can access it and like easily jump out and go into the normal world that may all be well well and good but i think that sort of depicts some realism from it. I don't think it would work well, okay? So, the things I really want to see is some more new gear sets, not just remastered, refeatured, recalibrated ones that they've put in from the last update. So, if you remember, the blind is now Banshee, and they've updated how the Firecrest works. The Alpha Bridge has had a I don't know how many patches um, to try and fix it, but uh, <laughs> yeah, um, yeah, and also some new mechanics I really want to uh, point out is the hunger, the thirst, and the health. Uh, so your hunger, obviously, you're gonna have to control your hunger through food, uh, consumables like energy bars, um, water water bottles and stuff like that, stuff that you'd normally give away to civilians, uh, mind you, which could prove a big difference, because if they're asking for food and you don't have it, then shit's gonna go down. Um, and something I'm really, really excited about, something the Division hasn't really done in a long time, is introduce a new faction to the... Um, to the game and don't really know what they are I don't really know what the faction's name is but from what I guess the uh, agent hunters because they um, they have like hockey masks on and like a big row of agent watches down the things to make them look badass and make them think that oh yeah we killed a lot of agents congratulations but these guys, are, I feel, are going to be no easy task to take down. I mean, level 32s by now are pretty easy to take down, even the elites. Um, but I think they're going to pose a new threat. I think they're going to be really, really solid to take down and pose a lot of challenges to teams and people playing solo as well. Um, I, f I feel like you'd need a team for this DLC, I think. I think you'd actually need to like sit down and say like look this is what we're going to do before we even get into the game sort of thing and yeah I think that's what it is so without further ado guys I'm going to leave you now with the um, with the survival trailer uh, that I picked up from IGN so I will see you all in that part of the video and well you won't actually because this is me signing off. I'm just going to leave you with the with the trailer to uh, sink your mouth into. And so yeah, thank you guys so much for watching these videos. If you do like them, give them a thumbs up. 
and that is uber uber appreciated and don't forget to subscribe if you're new around here and yeah just keep being awesome guys and i will see you all in the next video bye guys we've got a storm coming in listen it's worse than anything we could have imagined do whatever you need to do to get back alive you're needed